Well, hey there, church family. Pastor Jay here with a weekly update. I hope you are doing well. Today is March 30th, also known as Holy Tuesday. This is a day that many scholars believe that Jesus took his disciples up on the Mount of Olives and shared with them the, the death of Christ, but also the return and reign of Christ at the same time. And so uh, just need just to connect some dots in scripture to what's going on in the world today. And so we have Easter weekend coming up this weekend, lots of great things for you to know about. But before we get there, I want to remind you guys that we were having a prayer emphasis here at the church, an opportunity for you to come through and explore Six stations to pray through. Yes, you can pray at home, but the encouragement is to come here. There hasn't been a lot of people through, so there hasn't been a lot of people in the room at the same time. So come on up to the church and participate in this prayer thing. Let me take a real quick look and, and take a look at some of the prayer stations you get a chance to go through and just take a look at what's going to be involved. Well, that's our, our prayer stations. I hope that you saw a little bit of what you can come and experience, and I hope that you're wanting to come and be a part of it. So there's prayer times tonight from 7 to 8, tomorrow night from 7.30 to 8, uh, Thursday. There's going to be from 1 to 3 in the afternoon and again from 7 to 8, and then it's done. And then we're on to Friday, Good Friday, an opportunity for us to celebrate and look to and mourn the death of Jesus Christ on a cross but only mourn for a couple of days. That service Friday night is going to be at 6 p.m. We'll be in here. We'll be observing the Lord's Supper. I hope that you are uh, wanting to come and be a part of that. We're trying to make sure we have everything in place for social distancing and spacing out and, and just the things that we can to make sure that you know that we're thinking of you and you're, we're having and planning this service. And so... Uh, so Good Friday is happening at 6 p.m. again, but then on Sunday morning, Easter, we're going to have normal church services, 9.30 life groups, 10, 11 o'clock worship. What a great opportunity for us to come and celebrate the, the, the resurrected body of Jesus Christ and with the victory that brought for each of us. We'll be taking a look more about how we uh, need to know that the resurrection actually happened and how we can live our lives knowing that because it happened, we can face whatever the Lord brings our way because he is with us. He has victory over all of it. And so that's definitely some great, exciting things for us to know. But this Sunday, when you show up, uh, we may have more people than we have in a while. So if you can, uh, go ahead and park a little further away from the church, maybe across the street in the west parking lot, across the street, or uh, uh, maybe just further out from there. So that if we have any guests or visitors, they can park there and, uh, and know that that's just an opportunity for us to be nice to the people visiting our church. We've had quite a few visitors lately, so hopefully we'll have some more that are just interested to come and check out uh, what's going on. And if they come for Easter, we can share the message of Jesus Christ and leave the results to him. And so what a great thing for us to think about there. Uh, lastly, I want to tell you guys about our... Uh, family dinner that's happening on April 11th. This is basically our family dinner meeting, an opportunity to have a business meeting for our church to let you know what's going on. We haven't had one of these since I've been here, since before I was here. And so here's an opportunity for us to do that, talk about the last quarter and just celebrate what the Lord is doing here at the church through the work and the ministry here. And so we're going to be having this at 5 p.m. on the 11th. We're going to start with food, weather permitting, out on the parking lot, uh, grill some burgers and hot dogs, and uh, just give us a chance to go out there and have some food and fellowship, kind of tailgate style, sit in your car, sit on the you know, chairs, whatever you want to do, bring your chairs, get comfortable, and just enjoy the fellowship of being outside in the beautiful weather that we're having lately. And then from there, we'll move into the sanctuary and have our meeting and take a look more about what's going, what God's doing in the midst of Shady Oaks Baptist Church. And so I'm looking forward to uh, being a part of this with you guys, but I want to get through Easter first and really celebrate that. So when we get through Easter on April 5th, you need to register for that uh, family meeting so we know how to make sure how many burgers we need to make and how many hot dogs we need to make. And so please register shadyoaks.org slash events gets you there to register for that and gets us all set up and ready to go. And so guys, uh, the prayer thing's going on this week. Easter's happening this weekend and family church meeting uh, the, the following weekend. So there's stuff going on. You need to be a part of, you need to be informed, but you need to be prayed up 
So come join us at the prayer thing that's going on in the sanctuary. And then uh, come join us on worship this Sunday. Yes, there's virtual options, but if you can come out, we have masks, we have social distancing, and we'd love to see you in the building this weekend. We love you guys. Have a great, great time. And we will see you this weekend, the holiest weekend we have on the Christian calendar. Good Friday and Easter Sunday.